I've seen many people talking about um, nozzles and if you get a clog what you should do. Some people talk about burning it off, most people just say oh, they're very cheap so just chuck it and start with a new one which is probably the sensible thing to do but I have been curious as to how the burning off process actually goes so I want to give it a go with a couple of nozzles and see what happens. Got a small wire holder here, I've just fashioned out a wire, I just bent it around the nozzle and it's actually made it quite easy, you just can almost screw this in. And it's holding that in there. Okay, now we need the blowtorch. And the blowtorch is just a cooking blowtorch on a butane gas cylinder. And uh, didn't quite get it red hot, which is probably a good thing. But can we see through? Yeah, you can see the light through, so it looks fairly clear. Just let that cool off. So the nozzle's cooled off, and now I just want to clean out the inside. All I've got is a small stick, cocktail umbrella actually, and uh, then we have cocktails afterwards. This is really just to double check there's nothing left inside, no ash or anything that might cause another clog. And then give it a tap. Nothing actually came out when I tapped it on the table. So try spinning it, rub it against the stick, try and get all the way down. Yeah, nothing coming out, so that's quite amazing. When you blowtorch it straight off, it seems to clean it out pretty thoroughly just by doing that. And the nozzle is pretty clean. I think it probably depends on if you've got more plastic on the outside, you might have more residue. But this nozzle has come out quite good, so it is, uh, seems to be quite effective um, for a very quick burn. So, final test. I'll try the nozzle out and see how it goes. <laughs> 